Hello YouTube, what's up? It's I Love TV 2 here, and I am going to make my Q&A video following up to my 100 subs video thank you commentary I made yesterday. I am going to make the Q&A today, so this will be a link to that video, and if you haven't seen the video, you can go back and find it. I'll try to link it on the screen right around now if I can remember that I said to, to do that, but anyway, we're going to hop in on it. I got 10 comments, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Six, seven of them are actually questions. So, uh, first on screen, it's gonna. I'm gonna turn in my magic short bows. 60k fletching for that? Are you kidding? That's epic. All right, sweet. And then let's see what I get for the challenge bag. 40 frost. Holy! I spent like was it 400? Uh, it probably covers the covers the cost. I'm gonna get so distracted doing this. What I get? Okay. Okay. Um. But yeah, we are. I have a hundred and like four subs now, and I've never made a what's it called a Q and A before. So I was like, heck to the yeah, I'm gonna make a Q and A video. I think it'll be kind of sweet. So first question is, let me get this stuff set up on screen. I should have done this off screen, but I got so eager to make this video. All right, first question. Oh, that's not where I want to go. I'm leaving you guys so much. This is gonna be probably a two part video too, so you guys know. First question is, is would you ever start it? Uh, F2P series, meaning free to play series from Wiki MC Gamer. Gamin. That's a gamer. Wiki MC Gamer. <laughs> oh, I guess I can't. Okay. Um, so, would I ever make a free to play series? If he is talking about merchanting, um, I've definitely contemplated this many times. Like, I think it would be a pretty good series. Like, show pe uh, free to play people with like two mil how to make a little money off the GE if it's possible because it is possible I've done it before and uh, I used to only, only merge in free to play worlds meaning like I would go to the free to play world I would be like buying Guthix plate legs 150k they were more expensive than that but I'm just going to say 150k and then I'd go to the, run to the GE and sell them for 162k make 12k it's like it was nothing I'd make like 200k a day and I'd play like 8 hours it was it was pretty brutal but would I ever start a free to play series? Yes, I would start a free play free to play PKing series. I would start a free to play merchanting series because I know a lot of people are free to play. It's not always like, not every person can be as cool as Rook. <laughs> I'm just joking. But um, yeah. If, so free to play series, I can say definitely yes. If that's a good, if it gets good response, good everything, I'll keep it up and I'll keep on doing it. So thank you for that question, Wiki Game MC Gamer. Uh, yep. All right, next person's Eric Alonzo, who's been like the most loyal sub I've had. He's been around since I had like 30 subscribers. And he says, do you have any future plans to do with RuneScape after EOC comes out? And yes, I do. Um, once EOC comes out, I plan on trying to max my skilling stats. Minus, I don't know, if maybe there's a way to train, there'll be like a super easy way to train fast with EOC on like Slayer or something so I'll be like yeah or maybe they'll have non EOC worlds which would make my whole freaking day but um yeah my plans are to do these like mining get it to 99 get like fire making which I might get to 99 before that it's such an easy skill get like wood cutting 99 do a lot of like construction and all this stuff and get like do all my skilling until they like are like oh the EOC evolution of combat sucks we'll take it out and bring more players back or maybe the evolution of combat would be great. You never know. But I heard of rumors that it might not be like guaranteed that we have that, which would be kind of cool. And yeah. So future plans after EOC. Um, Mac getting my account. Like I already have max combat minus prayer. So, which I'm gonna work on prayer soon. So the only thing I'd really be missing out on is summoning and slayer. So. If I can in range and magic, but magic it doesn't really matter. I can elk, but I'll just be missing out on a little bit of that. But if I can do other skills like get herb lord ninety nine, get agility ninety nine, craft and I train all those other skills, get my total like twenty two hundred, twenty three hundred. I think that'd be kind of sweet. Um, so yeah, that is what my plans are after evolution and combat. Thank you, Eric Alonzo, for that question. And um, yeah. Next question, why do you have a shark with Down syndrome in your bank with a smiley face? And that is from Aslamos. We are going to run to my bank, and I'm going to show you my <laughs> Down syndrome uh, shark, which I 
I hope no one takes offense to that. If you have Down syndrome and you're watching my videos, I respect you. A person with Down syndrome won my... I'm guessing it's the Big Shark, right? They won my Homecoming King last year, which is kind of cool. Um, why do I have that? Where is he? It's because it's a random catch from fishing. So I got that randomly. And I got also have a giant swordfish, too. So it's kind of cool. It's kind of a cool thing that I got. And that is why I have a Down Syndrome looking um, shark in my bank. Oh, that was retarded. All right. Next, another question by Tud Frenzy sixty nine. Was I the hundredth sub? I'm gonna go with yes, you were, because I think if you were the hundredth sub, you would know. So if you think you are, I'm pretty sure you are. So yes, thank you to you, Tud Frenzy. All right. Next question is a pretty pretty tough one. I thought about it today when I was at college, which I am so cool. I'm gonna take a drink of water real quick. What was the best memory for you in RuneScape? And this is a deep question. Best memory for me. This is I could make a freaking series out of these memories, but uh, best memory for me didn't even happen on I Love TV Two. It happened on an account I have called Lil Jumbo. I know, pretty awesome name. But me and my friend Brian and Tyler had accounts Lil Jumbo. My friend Brian was Lil Mama Kill, and my friend Tyler was Lil Goomba, and they're all pure mages. Only only had mage except for Tyler. He got defense on Lil a uh, Lil Goomba had two defense on accident, and we would team up in the wild, just a couple of us, and we'd be like, we were like level 13 or something, and we would go, and we would uh, fight, oh, what are they called? Level 3 looters and stuff and all that. We'd kill people. We'd, like, team. It was so much fun. We, they would come over, and we'd stay up till like, 2 in the morning. Uh-oh. Did I lag? Oh, no, I didn't. Did I have to pause what I'm wearing again? Okay. And they, we, they would come over, and we would stay up. We only had, I only had one computer at my house at the time, so we would just do individual, like, I'd take a 15-minute shift. He would take a 15-minute shift, and then, like, another friend would take... We'd all sit there, and we just kept doing it over and over. It was so much fun. We wore monk robes, and we used, like, only, like, earth bolt, and then we would use... Oh, we'd use, like, wind... Not wind... Not even wind bolt. We'd use, like, fire strike, and then switch to wind bolt to get a hit or something. We never got anything good. It wasn't even, like, worth doing... But it was so much fun. And I still have that account. And we'd always make dumb pure accounts and just PK on them. We used to PK a lot. I never really thought of that. But yeah, I think I might make a series about uh, bit favorite memories. That'd be a fun random vlog series. I think I'm going to do that. So thank you, Fear and Hate, with a capital N and capital T for whatever reason. Um, yeah, so next question. I'm going to take, take a pause here because I think this is where I'm going to split the two videos up. So I'm going to end this clip here. And, um, yeah, so if you like this video, please subscribe for more. And I will see you guys tomorrow with part two. See ya.